Oh no! My novelty beach ball. Someone broke it. Uh, it was stupid anyway. But that is the bestest novelty beach ball I've ever had. Oh, who could have been so cruel? Blame it on Neil. Um, look, I'll buy you another one. No, don't do it. You will? Sure, but we kind of need to get going now. Oh, uh, is that going to be reimbursed though? Well, we did crash the car, so not likely. Smoking. Who's that dummy that crashed the car? Not me. It's pretty dark out. Aren't you kids scared? Of course not. We roleplay it anyway. What? Tommy's a super powerful knight and I'm a mighty magician. Yeah, we destroy all evil. Oh, that's uh, that's nice. Do you roleplay too? Not in this circumstance. I, uh, no? She's not cool enough to do it. Hey, I could if I wanted to. Just, just you children watch. Oh, a squirrel. A squirrel? What is he sleeping? Oh no, it's a terrible squirrel gone! What? Don't worry children, I'll protect you! What's going on? What? Is this for real? Why is Tommy to sleep? Has he been put under a spell? Uh, I guess we attack with the... What the fuck? Volcanic jump kick? That that sounds yelling loud, louder, loudest. I guess we do loudest. Your time is at an end, score gone. Hiya! Stop it! I'll be tell you. I'll be tell my your animal abuse. <laughs> yeah, she called the cops on you. What? I was just. I wasn't gonna. Didn't you say you liked the role playing? You liked the role playing? Not with squirrels, apparently. You shouldn't be ashamed of yourself. Let's name it Teddy. Okay. Let's just forget this happened. <laughs> okay, that was awesome. What do you want? You want some too? You want some volcanic cake thing? And I will scream the loudest for you. That came out wrong. But hey, we are fucking in the rain in the realm of role playing, so what couldn't happen? Is any context still right? Right, we have uh, arrived at the famed lighthouse. Let me just see what's inside. Hold on, what is that over there? This? The memory of River E. Wiles. Okay, that's the river from the river song. He wrote the song for him. For the river, oh, maybe it's not a him, maybe it's his wife or somebody. Was she John's wife? Don't know. Come on, the lighthouse house right, right there. I can see that. I need a moment. That's all. Oh, 
I've never been inside a real lighthouse. Come to think of it, have I even seen a real lighthouse? Holy shit. This is it! Okay, this is getting creepy. Are you using a telescope or just coming for this? A multicolored paper rabbit. Yellow and blue, is this some, from one of the paintings? Hey! This wasn't this wasn't here when we came last week. Oh yeah, Johnny must have came here before he fell ill again. This is the only one with two colors, huh? You know, these things actually look pretty hard to fold. Kind of an odd hobby though. Oh, that's my phone. It's Watts. Is everything ready? All right, I'll be right there. Why do you have a creepy ringtone? Because it scares the monsters away. Come on, let's head back. Received paper rabbit. We're weird. This right here, that's totally what it is. Oh, why don't you be late by another half an hour? Not like we're gonna die in Klein or anything. I got caught up in something. I got caught up in something too, it's called our job. Get off your high horse, I'm late just this one time and you milk it. At least tell me we're good to go. Of course we are, because I'm competent. Your helmet's on the couch, chop chop. Uh, what, is, what is it that we do? Do we create some kind of illusion for patient's final fulfillment or something? A painting of a woman holding something yellow and blue. Uh huh. Something yellow and blue. Like this. Save it again. Just, just in case. By the way, I'm curious. How does it work? Do you just write him another life like a novel? Uh, yes, I want to hear the explanation. No, we can't just make up new memories out of thin air. Then how do you do it? Not us. The machine does most of it. Naturally, since we aren't paid enough to get our hands dirty. In a nutshell, we simply travel through his memories to as early as possible. When we do, we would then transfer his registered desire of going to the moon to the reconstruction of the world and himself at the very at the very state at the early state and with the help of a wiki of data and his own the machine would then simulate re a rerun except this time he have the motivation of his registered desire with him all his life so you'd be depending on him fulfilling his own wish by simply having the desire to having the desire to how could that be everyone has ambition for things but most don't accomplish them. That's because in the real world, ambition fluctuate and fade. People start things with a passion, but eventually they lose that initial drive and slow down. But imagine if you locked that, locked onto that initial push through your entire life, never wavering. It's more powerful than it seems. That being said, no ambition is gonna help a dead man. We better go get started. Oh, of course, sorry. That's a really interesting idea. And yes, let's do get set up. What, what does the doctor have to say? Go on, I'll watch over his physical conditions through this procedure. Your helmet's on the couch, chop chop. Okay, the couch that's right here. Initiate. Alright, here we go. We're in sync. Mm -hmm. 
This should be the last accessible memory. Disable speech for all except Johnny. Done. Let's get him. At any time, you can view your position in time by moving the mouse toward the top of the screen. Holy shit! So he's an old man now. This doesn't change. Well, this is just crazy. So, what can we do about this? We don't have any paintings here. So this is his last memory. Uh, it's... Where is he then? River is already here. Is he at the lighthouse? Whoa. Johnny? What a pleasant surprise. We don't get many visitors around here. My name is Dr. Eva Rosaline and this is Dr. Von Matterhorn. Dr. Lorenzo von Matterhorn. What the heck? Dr. Neil Watts. Yeah, <laughs> bursting your bubbles here. Are you familiar with the Sigmund Agency of Life Generation? Oh, are you two from the agency? How convenient. I've just been thinking of calling you. Lily, get us some tea, please. Lily? She can't hear you. Actually, you've already called us. Oh, that's gotta be scary. We're here to fulfill our contract from the relative future. Careful there, if you slip off the cliff, we're gonna have to reload this memory. Oh, that's Neil. Watch him, Neil, show some respect. Eh, it's just a program, you know. I know, but this is his last accessible memory. And we need its cooperation. Worst comes to worst, we can just reboot it. Why would you waste time like that? You... Oh, this has got to be so trippy. You're here to take me to the moon, aren't you? Yes, John. I suppose I had a good run. Oh, this is getting... The, the emotions getting started. Not good enough, it seems. Nail you fucking butthurt man. So, can you do it? Can you take me to the moon? We can't, but you might be able to. Why do you want to go there? I don't know. It's fine. You can tell us. It's essential for helping us to get you to go there. Do you want the fame? The money? You've got to have a motive. I'm sorry, but I really don't know. I just do. I can already tell that this is gonna be a pain in the ass. Nevertheless, Johnny, here's what we will do. We need to get to your childhood. 
but it is too distant to do so in one memory hop. Thus, we will need to traverse through your memories with gradual backward leaps. Which you've given us the permission to do in the relative future. Once we lay down the waypoints in your childhood memories for direct access, we will return here. That's when you need to help us influence the childhood you to become an astronaut. Or to get on the giant catapult. <laughs> He's an asshole, but I can't help but find it funny. The point is, you need to have more to say than just I don't know. As long as you can take me to the moon, I will cooperate the any way possible. Good. Now, in order to lead to a memory, we need an item that is of importance to you. Do you have a memento of some sort to get us started? That'll do. Oh, that's the toy. Well, shall we? Ladies first. Huh. Is the, do we still have our own items? Yeah, hey, we got two blue and yellow paper rabbits. Receive note moon. We'll need to prepare this memento first. Let's do nothing for now and uh, see what we have. Notes. Objective, the moon in Johnny's memory is... The moon in Johnny's memory is full. Oh, a full moon. Yeah, what was I thinking? Uh, let's prepare the memento. What is going on? Complete the memento, collect the orbs to flip pieces? Excuse me? You mean I actually have to complete a puzzle? Well, not really. The memento can now be activated for traversal. Uh, let's activate it. Wait! What about my privacy? We'll try not to violate what we can avoid. But in most cases, it can't be helped. I hope you didn't do anything weird with your life. Oh, he's the, he has the little platypus here. And he's playing River Song. Turn off visibility and interactivity. It'd be, it'd be messy to be seen. Yeah, yeah, happy. Oh, this is insane. Jeez, what's with all these rabbits? You haven't seen what I have. This is creeping me out. We probably should have. We probably should have checked this record for psycho psychopathy first. What the? Did he hear me? That's impossible. It's probably just a part of this memory. Oh god. Then I stand by my point. Anyway, quit blabbering and find a memento here to hop from. Well, it's right here if you want it now, but do we want it now? Interact with uh, objects to establish five memory links. Okay, so good. We, we are not gonna just uh, find five objects immediately. A multi colored paper rabbit. Well, aren't you special having two colors when all your siblings look like they, down, they drowned in bleach? What's that? You think you're really creepy? Well, yes, I agree. That's one out of five. Uh, I'm guessing the platypus too? No? Really? Mm. 
The clock is moving, but soundless. Received a note about the clock. Okay, the the time apparently is another thing. The note says the 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 clock, the clocks in Johnny's room, Johnny's house never tick. Really, it doesn't work. Oh, it doesn't tick. It it works. Well, that's ideal, isn't it? I actually don't want to hear the clock ticking all the time. Memento discovered. Wait, what? Oh, we feed the memento to it. The umbrella thing. Okay, we just gotta need to find three more. The clock is already found. What's he doing here? Oh, he's too old. Glass pot of pickled olives. Peh, I hate this stuff. What's to hate? It's pickled olive. Exactly. Okay. <laughs> Questionable food choice is another memento. An old and a patched up backpack. What is this? A million years old? I guess we'll find out. Uh, no, then the patch that backpack. Are we just... Are we gonna open it though? Guess not. The selection of readings from medical journal that never changed. What is this? The Emperor's New Clothes by... Okay, familiar book. So, one more to go. Don't. If we have to explain our presence to him at every memory, I'd go crazy. Don't tempt me. Fresh wild flowers. Okay, that's uh, five mementos. Oh, uh, you know what? I'm really glad that we don't we don't automatically just jump to the next one every time we find all five of them, just so we can further explore if we if we'd like to. I like it when games give me that choice. Hadouken! What the... Egg or everything about this was that? What? That's it, I'm doing the breaking from now on. What? I, I think it's kind of cute. You can travel with the memento umbrella. Okay, let's travel with the umbrella. Ooh, loading. Having just played a ton of Resident Evil recently, I have a deep mistrust with umbrellas. Uh, reminded the corner orb can flip the entire diagonal. Oh, that seems pretty alright with me. What's the flip? Oh. So, what does this do? Well, that's just more messy. Here we go. Wait, I just wanna... Activate Memento! Are we back or is this... When it comes to rain, through is better than on two. I don't mind it regardless. Seems like these memory hops only span a short period of time. We need to find a leaping memento or it's gonna take forever. Eh, just enjoy the scenery. It's raining! And all the stuff the toy platypus. 
Honestly, I just don't think this animal has the right to exist. The world's not big enough for two of you. Yeah, well, he's carrying that thing around. Let's check out the lighthouse. Requires three bars of memory links to proceed. Oh, uh, I, I guess I have two bars. I didn't know that was a thing. So we need to go further. Or is there something else I missed? No, that's the platypus. Oh, in memory of River E. Wiles. The tombstone. And now the lighthouse is open to us. It's finished, River. Like you, I'll be able to watch over her every day. She won't be alone anymore. I never understand why, but I stay true to your wish. I'm sure Anya is grateful to you too. Is that their daughter? But when I'm gone, who is going to watch over us? Who are you? My name is Eva. I was just passing by. Is she your wife? Yes, her name was River. That's a special name. It didn't need to happen. She... She didn't need to do it. But she... You don't understand. I don't. We just straight up disappeared off. Since Rosaline is beginning to take a more personal interest in old man, I wonder if that would have been uh, Dr. Watts if we had chosen him to uh, do the initial exploring. It doesn't seem like it's the kind of character though, but that's curious. I just don't know if that choice had any ramifications at all. Received a note from Anya. Someone John and River cared for. So it's. I'm thinking daughter or maybe not. Just but someone also lost to them. About time you got here. I almost thought you fell off the cliff. What were you doing? Enjoying the scenery. What else? Any luck here? Big luck. Huge. Dinosauric. Huh. This place looks pretty empty. It's a lighthouse. What do you expect? I don't know. Paper rabbits? Anyway, I'll catch you on the other side. Have fun re-breaking the barrier for yourself. Dang. Uh, let's see here. A broken lighthouse lamp. Whoa! Uh. Well, a lighthouse lamp that is broken really doesn't have a lot of... Ooh! It's protected. Okay, we are ready to teleport again. Can I interact with him? Nope. I'm giving you all my balls. This is trippy. Ideal shows the minimum of moves the memento can be completed. In. Oh! So there's an extra challenge. Hmm. I better think this through then. The ideal is three. And if we reverse these two. Uh, yeah, I think. 
Oh, I didn't know these are... <laughs> oh, oh my god, I, I screwed up. I thought that was like three... Three levels, but this is actually four. Oh well. Not ideal. But not terrible. I wonder if it affects anything. Do I get to talk to him now? Nope. Okay, let's activate this little guy. So, this is like middle age. Just enough. Is that Anya? After we pay for your operation, we just have enough left for it. So don't you worry. Oh, that's River. White Lie. That's what you call it, right? No, I, I'm sure we can just stop it. I don't like it when you lie. They already have all these paper bunnies all over the place. The platypus is right here. I calculated our finances. I know how it's like. Why do you try to convince me against my will? We need the money for your medical bills, River. I understand that Anya means a lot to you, but this... This is just too much. I mean, she... She isn't even... Okay, at this point, I have a few guesses. Like, Anya probably is not a human being in the nor or at least no one in the normal condition i'm thinking maybe it's their daughter but that's brain dead or or maybe not that, that not their daughter maybe she's trying to say she isn't even our daughter or maybe maybe anya is not a human maybe she's a puppy okay these are really wild guesses based on nothing let's just continue do you know what makes me happy johnny I should bloody hope so. You've been married for how many years now? What? Uh oh. Do you? Well, I do. I just hope you can help me with it. River. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. When the papers for my treatments get here, I will not sign them. What you do with our money is up to you. But if you would grant my wish, I want you to use it to finish building the house. And then, for every day that you live there, I want you to watch over her. Visit her, speak to her, comfort her. I don't want her to be alone anymore. about you happy I'll be happy Johnny yes I made this is this the oh the blue and yellow tell me what it is what just tell me what it is It's a rabbit, like all the others we made. What else? Um... <laughs> inappropriate joke. Even at the end, it's all trick questions. Um, it's made of paper. What else? Its body is yellow and the rest is blue. Good. What else? Just, he's like, God damn it, woman! Look, River. Oh, he put it aside. Don't do that. I wrote a song. It's for don't don't dismiss. That's nice. That's really nice for him. But don't dismiss her. Don't dismiss her things. Okay. Oh, that's the River song. Well, 
Would you like to hear it? Yes. You didn't have to bring the piano in here for this. I can hear you just fine with the door open. There's something that she's not getting either. It's called forever. Why so cliche? <laughs> it's just a placeholder, and it's a permanent one. I'm too manly for this. I'm heading on. I already got my memory links. You wanna hitch a quick ride or look around yourself? I'm gonna stay and explore. Go on ahead. I'll catch up with you. Don't you miss the days when memory audio to MP8 conversion was legal? I think I brought home over two thousand songs during my first year on the job. That's a unexpected job quirk. I never thought about that. The Emperor's still closed by Hans Christian Andersen. Oh, so if I had left with him now, I would have missed all of this. Oh, wait, dude. Oh, bloody wait. What about this little thing? Not a memento this time. Received note: Paper Rabbit. What river gave to John? Why would they? Why are they always reading the Emperor's new clothes? What's the significance of that story to this one? Ah, that's the memento. So I'm guessing a song is another one. Note for River. A song Johnny wrote for his deceased deceased wife. Its titles is a placeholder. She got to hear it in her lifetime, that's something. Where are you? A pot of mixed dough. What? <laughs> it's a little random. Or at least it seems. A glass bottle of pickled olives. Summer really likes these. Uh, what about you? This guy is called Nicholas. I'm telling you, there's just no way. What if we take it apart? Look at us, John. We aren't exactly at the ripe age of piano moving. You know what? If this means that much to you, I'll pay for the professionals to do this. I can't help saving that house for you, so oh, I can't help saving the house for you. So this is the least I can do. That's how they moved the piano upstairs, just for her to hear River Song. Well, we got all five of them. I don't want to just continue to listen to this music, but I guess we can. <laughs> I'm wondering if this, all of these videos are gonna be copyrighted a million times. It's still worth it. I don't really care about it. <sighs> okay, here we go. Breaking the barrier here. 